It's a growing part of downtown Las Vegas. In the last few years, the medical district has added UNLV's medical school to UMC, Valley Hospital, of course. But what's missing? City leaders wanted to find out. It sprouted up in the shadow of downtown. So much. We have, so much is missing. City Councilman Brian Knudsen sees the medical district as key to an urban core. There's a lot of great physicians here. There's a lot of great nurses here. But we need integrated systems of health care to improve the access to and quality of health care for every Southern Nevada resident. So what's next? City staff recently put together this report to get some answers. Research laboratory space is critical. We need space so that we can hire and recruit some of the best scientists to do research that directly impacts our community. The city's report shows Nevada is way behind its neighbors in bioresearch facilities. In strictly dollars and cents, the state got around $41 million in National Institutes of Health funding in 2019. Utah and Arizona, more than $200 million. That means Las Vegas loses out on top-end research and patients leave town to get that crucial care. A laboratory is going to allow us to do the types of testing that are important as we develop our transplant programs and our oncology programs. It's going to increase the opportunities for Southern Nevadas to go to school, get high credentials, and go in and get a great paying job. The report suggests the city invest in bringing major research to Las Vegas and create room for it. Some of that work's already started, and discussions are underway on construction and outreach. Those in the medical district hope to discover a pipeline of talent and care. Any construction on research lab space downtown is still a few years away, but work is certainly in the works.